High five. Bringing you the weird and wild from the world of MMA each and every weeknight. Welcome to Midnight Mania. Generally speaking, there are two types of old people boxing matches. On one hand, there's the considerably safer exhibition matches, a label which includes rules aimed at safety, i.e. shorter, fewer rounds, and does not necessarily produce a winner, think, are still open for anyone who doesn't care about symbolism, because why not? Insomnia I do not fully understand the usage of the tire, but I would never question Anderson Silva. Jim Miller's 38th trip to the Octagon has been delayed, here's wishing the veteran a speedy recovery. Whatever happened next does not matter, Green Hoodie takes the W. This account tweets out satirical UFC, MMA headlines, and it's worth a follow. Jiu-Jitsu nerds are an entirely different breed. I could watch people try to punch Francis Ngannou in the gut all day. Slips, rips, and co-clips I do not feel like the MMA community is appropriately hyped for the return of Nick Diaz. Sure, he's older now and probably won't look like Peak Diaz, but he's R-E-M-A-T-C-H-I-N-G Robbie Lawler. This is historic. These two were slinging shots. High-flying techniques are cool, but not as cool as breaking down someone's ability to stand up. Random land porcupines do not play around. Midnight music, MF Doom forever. Sleep well maniacs. More martial arts madness is always on the way. Punch the like button and kick the subscription bell.